Hey, everyone. Welcome back to the Tenorshare channel. Samsung just dropped its latest S25 series, and many people are eyeing one of these, or a budget-friendly Samsung phone with great value. If you've just got your new device, it's time to transfer all your data and make the most of your new phone. In this video, we'll explore the easiest and fastest ways to transfer photos and files, including two free methods that are way quicker than the usual options. Whether you're upgrading from an older Samsung or helping someone else make the switch, these tips work for most Samsung devices. Let's get started. Method 1. Use Smart Switch to transfer data. Samsung has a built-in program called Smart Switch, which makes transferring data super easy. To get started, open settings on your old Samsung phone. Go to Accounts and Backup, then choose Bring Data from Old Device. You can use it during your S25 setup process, or later through the settings or app. Now, set your old phone as the sending device and your S25 as the receiving device. I'll walk you through how to use a cable for the transfer. You can do wireless too if you like. For a cable transfer, plug in the old phone first, then connect the new one. Let it search and then decide if you want to transfer everything, only certain items will go fully custom. If you choose the custom option, you'll see a list of transferable data like contacts, messages, apps, and even wallpapers. You can pick specific photos, entire albums, videos, or files to transfer. Once you've made your selections, just hit transfer. The process starts immediately, and you'll see the progress on the screen. The time it takes depends on how much data you're transferring. For a stable and faster experience, stick with the cable transfer. If your friends or family are dealing with a massive amount of data or switching between iPhone and Android, check out iTransGo. It's a powerful tool that lets you transfer everything easily and without resetting your phone. You'll find the link to it below. After a while, your data will be transferred to the new Samsung phone by Smart Switch app. All the data you choose will be transferred, even the wallpaper. And all the data have been well organized. If you're looking for something even simpler for daily use, here's another trick. Method 2. Use Google Photos to transfer a large number of photos. If you're looking to a way to just move photos without reset the new 25, Google Photos is your go-to solution. Install the Google Photos app on your both phone from the Play Store. Then open the app, sign in with your Google account, and start uploading all the photos you want to transfer. Once the upload is complete, grab your new Samsung 25, get the Google Photos app, and log in to the same Google account. Then all your photos are there, ready to download or view. It is easy to manage and transfer large amounts of photos without worrying about cables or manual work. Besides using apps like WhatsApp or email, you can quickly transfer files via Bluetooth. Just enable Bluetooth on both devices, open the photo or file you want to share on your old phone, select the file, hit share and choose Bluetooth. Wait for your S25 to appear on the list, select it and approve the transfer. That's it, your file will be sent in no time. Personally, I love this method for small transfers. It's quick and hassle-free, but if you're dealing with a large amount of data, Smart Switch is definitely the way to go. Thanks so much for sticking with us. We hope this video helps make your data transfer process smooth and stress-free. Don't forget to subscribe to the Tenorshare channel for more.